This is the story of how elite liberal insiders are getting richer, while ordinary Canadians get poorer. Here's how it's happening, and how they're trying to hide it. When Canada first encountered the COVID-19 virus, there was a concern around our supply of ventilators. Luckily, Justin Trudeau had an idea. He gave 237 million of our tax dollars to Bayless Medical Company, Inc., owned by Frank Bayless. Who is Frank Bayless? Frank Bayless is a former Liberal MP and elite friend of Justin Trudeau. You see, Canada has lobbying laws, which prohibit MPs from lobbying the government for five years after leaving office. This means Trudeau couldn't directly hand our tax dollars to his friend Bayliss. But that didn't stop the government from quickly awarding the contract to Bayliss in spite of Canada's lobbying laws. The cherry on top, Trudeau seemingly overpaid for each ventilator by $10,000 or $100 million overall. Justin Trudeau, of course, denies that he knew anything about the government giving a quarter of a billion dollars to a former Liberal MP. But internal documents say otherwise. Here, you can see an email thread from Trudeau's staff. They name Bayliss directly and celebrate him getting approved. How did Trudeau's team directly name Bayliss if they had no idea he was later involved? While these liberal elites get richer, ordinary Canadians are getting poorer. Canada has been taking on some of the highest levels of debt on the entire planet, but we still have the highest unemployment rate in the G7. Justin Trudeau thinks we are stupid. He thinks we are going to keep putting up with this corruption. The only reason corruption like this is allowed to continue is because the media is keeping voters in the dark. We need your help to show voters what is really going on with this government. So like, comment, and share this video with your friends and family. Because the future of our country is in your hands.